Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Friends, this is assignment 12. That is final assignment of this course problem solving through programming in C. I have done the videos from week 1 onwards. So if you like my attempt, so keep encouraging me. And if you are new to our channel, subscribe our channel, like this video and share to your friends. And coming to the first question, friends, these all are my most probable answers and i have got results for all those questions most of these questions so coming to first question which of the following cannot be a structure member so they have given a another structure error and function and none of the above as answers so the answer for first question is option c function coming to second one which of the following is true so they have given some statements so the answer for second question is option d all of the above all these mentioned a b c all are correct so option d is correct answer for second question coming to third one what is the output of the following program they have given a small program and they are asking about the output so friends here is somewhat tricky because I have got the answer as 1101011 I will show you 110 again 11011 if you see this the same is present in option B and the same is present in that is option B and, and also option C so it's your choice to select between op op both options b and option c any one of those are correct but we don't know how they evaluate so let's go with the first given option the correct answer so i'm going with option b c also correct answer only let's see whether they will award marks for both b and c and coming to fourth question assume size of an integer and, and a pointer is 4 byte what will be the output of the following program they have given a program so the output for the following program by assuming size of integer and pointer s is 4 byte so the answer for fourth question is option b that is 48 so mark option b 48 as correct answer for fourth question coming to fifth one what will be the output of the c code given below so a C program is given and they are asking about the output. So fifth question when I have done this in C compiler, I have got option C that is 0, 1, 2, 4, 5. So option C is correct answer for fifth question. And coming to sixth one, again they have given a code and they have given a small information that address of x assumed to be 2000 in decimal and an integer requires 4 bytes of memory by assuming x address of x as 2000 and integer requires 4 bytes like above problem so 4 bytes and they are asking about the output here x plus 3 asterisk x plus 3 asterisk of x plus 2 plus 3 that means asterisk, asterisk of x plus 2 plus a 3 additional so they are going to print these three values here first one refers to x plus 3 second one to star of that means asterisk of x plus 3 and third one goes to asterisk of x plus 2 and plus 3 so the answer for sixth question is option a that is 2036 2036 
2036 it means both three values will game will give same value that will results in 2036 so mark option a as correct answer for sixth one sixth question so coming to seventh one they have given a code snippet it a program so i have done this in my compiler and i got the answer for seventh question as option b false so mark option b as correct answer for seventh question coming to eighth question that is calling a function f with an array variable with an array variable a of 3 where a is an array is equivalent to so eighth question answer can be option d all of the above methods are correct that means f of a of 3 f of asterisk a plus 3 f 3 of a all options are correct so that is option d coming to last but one question that is ninth question when f open method is not able to open a file it returns so what it will returns it returns option b that is null it returns a null when it does not open the file we usually open file by using f open method if it does not work then it will returns null so mark option b null as correct answer for ninth question and coming to 10th question that is final question of both assignment 12 and this course they have given a lagrange's polynomial table for three data points 10 15 20 and their y values is that means we should treat y equal to f of x that means f of 10 as 3 f of 15 as 5.2 that for 10 for 3 and 20 for f of 20 is 6.8 so they have given equation l not x into 3 plus l1 x into 5.2 l2 x into 6.8 and they have given l1 of x x at x equal to 3 we have to find the value of l1 of x at x equal to 18 friends uh, when i have performed this i have got the answer as 2 point sorry i am showing once again 2.561 so it is somewhat related to option c only because 2.56 and 2.67 it means some little bit errors will be there or decimal corrections so i am going with option c if you are clear with your answer you can comment in the comment section so other others will also see so i am going with option c i am going to submit these answers so friends if you like this video and my efforts since the first video subscribe our channel like this video and share to your friends keep supporting and encouraging me like this until then be safe be happy thank you bye